and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna show you how I make Vietnamese fresh spring rolls. Okay, so here are the ingredients I have for the spring rolls. I bought one pound of shrimp. It, it has the head, the tails, and everything. A little bit over one pound. Two and a half pound of pork belly. Gonna take it out. This is pork belly. And let me take out the shrimp and show you. So this is the shrimp I got. This is a little bit over one pound. And the rice stick is rice stick. Uh, so this is the, I'm gonna use half of this. I got the um, rice, paper rice, chili, hot chili, oil, hoisin sauce. I bought the second bottle just in case. I get the um, peanut butter peanut butter, sugar, lettuce, what else, cucumber, I got peanuts, Roasted peanuts and salt. So I believe that's almost all that I need. I think I need garlic, which I will chop it up in a, in a minute. So, and um, when I was at the market, they did not have fresh mint, and so I thought about uh, my uh, my neighbor. The landlord, he grew a lot of mint outside, so after this, I'm going to go outside and uh, cut some mint. So, that is all I have for the ingredients. Now, let me show you how I make it.
So I boiled for about 30 minutes. It's also drink it up with cold water. Okay, so I'm back and after I uh, boil the shrimp, beautiful, this is the belly, pork belly, it's all cooked, no red, and I'm gonna cut the uh, cucumber and some some um, lettuce I'm gonna cut in two. So let me do this first. I'm gonna do the cucumber first. It's about an inch, an inch and a half. Now we have everything ready and it's ready to roll. Look at my shrimp and pork belly slicing shrimp in two pieces and pork bellies. I got the veggie. Now I'm gonna. So this is the hot bowl of water right here. Yeah. Dip it in hot water. Cucumber. My mint. This is the white noodle, the rice noodle that I need. It's right here. And then the shrimp is this part is face down. Alright, let's see how we do this. Get closer. Tuck it in on both sides and then here we go. <laughs> you get one, one rope. <laughs> now let's do another one. We don't want to put too much in the stuffing because it will break. So uh, just get a little bit of everything, two pieces, and then two pieces of shrimp again, face down. Now 
Let's do this. Tuck both sides in, in and then roll it. You got another one. <laughs> Beautiful, isn't it? After you wrap it, make sure you cover it real quick. You don't want the, the rice paper to get so dry. So cover it up. No air coming. Make the sauce. Now to uh, fry the garlic, I chop two cloves of garlic and put them here. I keep brown first, and then I put the sauce, sauce inside. I measure five tablespoons of the hoisin sauce. I'm gonna do one more. So that's six tablespoons of hoisin sauce. Put it back in. So what I did with the, the broth that I cooked the um, belly pork, this one, I've got to use that broth to mix the sauce. And I use one tablespoon of peanut butter. I'm going to do one and a half. It's not watery, and it is good. Up the skin of the bronze. After you, after you peel them off, you're gonna cut them into half. Make sure you get the vein out from the shrimp. See this black vein? Take it out.
Okay, I'm back. Woo, that was over an hour of, of work. Now it is time to enjoy the labor of love. I make two dishes, three for, per person, three to four per person. And this is the sauce that I make. See, it's not watery, it's just about right. And this is the peanut. I just crush it, put some on here. And the chili sauce. See how pretty this look? Ah. <laughs> mm. It's such a hot day today, and when I record, I cannot have the fan on, so it's making more hot. All right, let's enjoy our labor of work. I think when I bought the the rice paper this time, I think accidentally I um, I put something on top of the rice paper, so it kind of break. So when I roll it, it's, it's broken. It's not into one piece. It, it was a little hard for me to roll, but I'm still able to make it. So good. It is so good. I love the sauce. Mm. Just perfect. Mm. I hope you enjoy my video of how to make fresh, tasty, like uh, uh, Spring roll, spring rolls. In the next video, I'm planning to make beef jerky. My husband is an expert in it right now, and I've been asking him how to do it. I did it one time. It didn't come out right because I forgot one important ingredient. So I'm gonna try it again, but this time I'm gonna write down exactly how he does it and I'm gonna demonstrate how I make 
beef jerky. Thank you for following my video. I hope uh, you learned something uh, new um, from me how to make spring egg rolls. I hope to see you on my next video. Take care now. Bye bye.